Who's up for a quick unboxing video? Recommended by my friend. A special thing arrived. And here it is. A BBC Micro Bit. Go. This is the Go version which has a book and a charger part for it. And, or not charger, a power supply for it. Let's get it open and have a look. £17 off of Amazon. This one. Zoom you out a bit. Let's have a check, let's have a look, what's this book first of all? We've got, looking for a challenge. Once you've got to grips with your BBC Micro, but get stuck into some other great ideas. Idea one, rock, paper, scissors. Oh, so it's telling you to go to these places and these addresses, and there'll be some code there, I guess. Get to know your BBC Micro bit. Get set up. Power up your Micro bit by connecting it to the battery pack. Press the buttons when your BBC Micro bit asks you to and watch the lights display cool patterns and games. Before you get code in, check out the pre-programmed commands to test your BBC Micro bit. Let's get started. Connect your BBC Micro bit to the battery pack or your computer with a USB cable. Give your BBC Micro bit a shake. Can you turn on the entire light grid? Play chase the dot. Tilt your BBC Micro bit to catch the flashing dot with the steady dot. So that's like snake. Go to microbitworld.me, lots of tutorials. Select your code and editor that you would like to start with. When you finish creating your script, press run to see it play on the screen simulator. Connect your micro bit to your computer using a micro USB cable. Compile your script. Interesting. A safety guide. Yeah, let's not. What's this? Find me in here. I guess this is going to be the micro bit then. Power supply, a micro USB cable, I'll add that to the collection, batteries included, let's get this opened up, there we go, we'll get these batteries in here first, I can't believe it, batteries included, I never hear of that these days, batteries not included I thought was the score, right we've got the batteries in the battery pack, that wasn't too much hassle, this is a very cool packaging for, what does it say, find me in here and then get coding. Larshy blows, absolutely tiny. There's a button there, oh and these will be the LEDs. Buttons here and a little serial number and some connections at the bottom. Come in a wee bit this way. There we go. Let's get it plugged in for the first shot of a brand new micro bit. So what did it say? Shake it to turn it on. Oh, it's came on already. Maybe turn that back down again. So you can see the lights. What's it saying? Hello. Hey. Very flashy. B. Press that. Shake. Oh, light up all the lights. Is that what we're trying to do? Nearly. There we go. Oh. So it's got an accelerometer in here, which can obviously tell when it's shaking. Chase the dot. So on this guy, oh, it's weird. It's, it's strange to have. It's like it's strange for the. Oh. Okay. What did that say? No. Get coding. Ah, oh, right, okay. Well, it's very cool that that um this game's really weird, like how it how the oh, it's, I'm not very good at it, but it's really weird how the game responds to the accelerometer. You don't expect to the LEDs to respond like that. Score. Alright, don't, can we just have another shot, please? There. 
So we're just playing snake. Oh, I see what happened. I ate my own tail. Very quickly. Come on. Quickly. What's my score? Oh, didn't even tell me. Five. Maybe I was expecting me to be a bit better than that. Oh, I'm terrible at this. I was terrible at it on the, the old Nokia phone as well. Oh, I ate my tail again. Anyway, that's uh, that's the micro bit out of its box. Hopefully we'll have uh, some very cool projects going with that in the not too distant future. Be sure to subscribe to check back on that. Thanks for watching.